You want to take advantage of all that Las Vegas has to offer, but when you start looking for your new home, you realize that there's very little inventory on the market right now. So what do you do in a situation like this? In this video, I will give you a full breakdown on what the luxury inventory looks like in Las Vegas and what you can expect when shopping for your new home here. So as most of you are aware, Las Vegas is suffering from low inventory as with most of the US. Um, here for luxury listings, which is $1 million and above, we currently have 932 active listings, which is down about 1% from last month. So what does all of this mean to you? Sellers just really aren't selling unless they have to, because if they sell their home, they're going to have to purchase another home at a much higher interest rate, which means they probably can't afford the home they're actually living in anymore. <laughs> so why would they sell? Um, so this is one of the problems that's um, contributing to our tight inventory. Things such as job changes, marriages, deaths, and extenuating additions to the family, such as um, elderly parents moving in, or sometimes there are adult children moving back home. These are the reasons why people are selling. And it's also one of the reasons why next-gen living is so big when we talk about the new construction world. The number one problem I'm seeing in the market right now is that the majority of our um, inventory is functionally obsolete. People don't want to spend a million plus dollars on a home that they have to renovate as well. And building and renovation costs have gone up extremely high compared to a year or two ago. So these things have made people decide to sell but also have created a problem with buyers not finding what they want. So when there are those homes that are the gems, they don't last long. People see them, they've been waiting for them, and they're ready to pray. So as a buyer, when those homes do come up, you have to be ready to act quick. And that's where I come in because I can help prepare you and guide you through the preparation process. So when that hidden gem or that perfect dream home does come on the market, you're ready to put in an offer that is competitive and strong. I recently had the pleasure of working with a couple who came to me from California and they only had six weeks to close on a property. So before they even made their trip here, two weeks prior, we started working together and I prepared them for everything they needed to know and also all of the things that they needed to have in line in order to make a competitive and strong offer should they find their house when they were coming to visit me in two weeks. And of course, like most people, they wanted something that was a single story, brand new or newly redone, and on a large lot. So I really had my work cut out for me to find this for them in a very short amount of time. But I actually did find them a home and it checked all their boxes. But the key was the preparation. They were 100% prepared to make an offer if they found something. Because I was able to guide them through all of those preparatory steps, when we did find that dream home on that very first visit here to Vegas, they were able to put in a competitive offer and they secured the property and it will be completed for them by the end of November, which was their goal. Hi, welcome to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Lisa Lopez and I was born and raised in Las Vegas. I drop videos every week all about luxury living in Las Vegas and the Las Vegas market. Make sure you like and subscribe and don't forget to hit the bell so you get notified each time I drop a video. I ended up finding my client an off-market brand new home with lots of land, but like I said earlier, if you're needing to move to the Las Vegas area, your best bet will be to get with an agent like myself who not only has experience, but is also very well connected with other agents that might have these hidden gem listings coming on the market or 
a very strong connection in the community to be able to hear about all of these off market or coming soon diamonds in the rough. And not to mention, you're also going to need guidance on how to get the best deal on these homes as well. There are a lot of incentives, especially when talking about um, the off market new builds that we can negotiate that as a buyer, you would have no idea even what to ask for. I've been closely monitoring the new build situation around the valley and I'm very pleased to report that there are builders who are recognizing the need for more homes in the valley and we do have some that will be releasing lots very soon in the valley. So if you're interested or if you're thinking about moving to Las Vegas, um, reach out to me because I'll be able to help you um, reserve one of these lots and hopefully negotiate something that works best for your wants and needs. But again, even with these builders taking lot reservations, it doesn't solve the immediate need for a buyer because these homes can take anywhere from nine to sometimes 18 months to complete and some people need to move here right now. So again, working with a professional who knows how to find all of these hidden homes will really benefit you. I will be doing some videos in the near future to highlight some of these communities, but in the meantime, if you have any questions, feel free to reach out to me now. Um, I do want to point out there is a downside to going with some of these new construction homes. But before we get into that downside, let's do a quick pop quiz. What is the number one problem in resale homes on the market today? A, sellers need to lease back. B, buyers are afraid to purchase homes because of the interest rates. C, most resale homes are functionally obsolete, or D, resale homes don't have enough land. Comment your answer in the comment section below. Okay, so let's get back into the downside of purchasing a new construction home right now. With rates in question, buying a home can be very daunting, especially when buying a new construction home. Let me explain why. So, if you go to contract today and the rate is 8% and it's going to take nine to 18 months to close on that property, you can't lock your rate until 45, sometimes 60, 60 is pushing it, but 45 days before closing. So what happens a lot is someone can afford something now, but if the rates go up, they can no longer afford it or they don't want to pay that payment anymore. Sometimes some builders and lenders offer a uh, float down clause. I don't see it very often, but what it says is you can lock your rate months in advance and if the rate ever floats down, you can then move and lock your rate at that lower rate but it doesn't happen often. So as you can see, the market is not impossible to conquer. It can be daunting, but that's why it's important to work with an experienced agent. So as you can see, the market is not impossible to conquer. You'll just want to be sure that you are working with an experienced agent, someone who is very well versed in the inventory, and also someone who has has um, very strong connections with other real estate agents and their own sphere in the community so that they can stay abreast of what's coming on the market or what is listed off market and the condition of those properties. And also someone who is very knowledgeable in the incentives that can be negotiated in your transaction so that you can be sure that you're not only finding and buying your dream home, but you're also getting the best possible deal that can be made in the entire package. 
I hope you found the information in this video helpful and if you need any assistance in finding your new home or listing your home for that matter, please feel free to reach out to me anytime. I would love to come alongside you and help you on your journey. For more videos about Las Vegas and Henderson, make sure to click on one of the videos around me. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell so you get notified each time I drop a new video. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you next week.